I want to keep, I want to end this story. There's a GoFundMe page. I want to put it on and we're going to, we're going to wrap it up now. Cause I usually wrap it up in here. <clears throat> so I got, when, when, you know, I've always heard this saying that every, any, anyone and everybody's worst days is somebody's best day. Right. And I happen to have a, a, a family friend, a whole bunch of fam. They're all like this whole group of family that are like family to me. Their, their son was in a bad car accident. And you know, they had a GoFundMe page a while ago. And, you know, I contributed. You, you think they're in an accident and they're just helping with some hospital bills. And you didn't realize what was really going on. And, I, you know, and, and I just wanted to shout out. And over the weekend, you know, I've gone up and down with things going on in my life. And I think, you know, I'm just going through a rough time and blah, 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 blah. And you think that's bad. And you compare it to... Their son is still, you know, rehabilitating, but he's got brain, you know, he had some brain damage. They're, they're helping, they're doing a lot of pieces and, you know, it's costing them, you know, well over 30 to 40,000 a month just to keep them going. And it, they're seeing some improvement, but it's a long journey. So, you know, we're going to post it in here. If you get a chance, you know, please, um, every dollar counts. I mean, if they had to pay 39,000 because they got, you know, people to donate, you know, a, a hundred people donating a hundred bucks, that would be fantastic, you know, um, and I'll post it, it'll be posted in here, Santiago, you'll post it, it'll be on my Facebook page, I'm sharing this with you, because I know everyone's got, there's only so many places you could donate to, and I understand that, whatever you can, but when I hear the story, I didn't realize it, and they're my friends, you know, they, they're, the, they, they, they're, the, 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 my buddy, the father drives five hours, back and forth, which is 10 hours to go to a house they had to buy in the Orlando area to spend time with their son to rehab. The mom lives there um, and she's with her son every day. They got nothing but a positive attitude. And then I see myself thinking that I'm thinking I'm having a rough time. And then you put that in comparison to that. Uh, I was broke my heart and it made me change just like in an instant, like nothing can be that bad, right? Whatever I think is bad, it could be worse somewhere else. So I'm getting these texts in and they're sending me it here. So I just wanted to be a shout out that, you know, every time you think you're having it bad, <clears throat> and you could hear my voice getting bad now. Every time you think you're having it bad, your bad day is somebody else's best day. And, and you know, the, the father's working, you know, he's got his business, but he's working every dime he has, he's putting towards, and it's their kid. And, you know, by the way, he was already going into the fire. He already got accepted to a firehouse. He went to the fire academy. So he was going to be serving the community as a fireman, uh, a first responder, which, you know, Byron is, is close to Byron's heart. So please, if you see the GoFundMe pays, any dollar, anything that helps counts, just imagine spending that kind of money every month with the hopes. And, and when you talk to these people, they're nothing but caring, loving people, like, you know, I'm, I'm almost miserable compared to what they are. And I'm not even going through one tenth of that piece. So, so please, you know, when you see it, whenever you can, I'm going to be promoting this for a while. Um, Cause it just broke my heart when I sat down and we went to breakfast just to enjoy each other. And then they told me, you know, what was going on. And in fact, I had forgotten. And, and she had told me, Oh, Victor, thanks for contributing. And this was months ago. I go, Oh, no problem. You know, your family expect it. You know what I mean? I didn't know how the severity of how it was continuing. So, so just, you know, love your family, you know, send out nice texts to your family, your parents, your cousins, your kids, your, your, your friends, your whatever. You never know things can change in a heartbeat like that. And number one, and number two, nothing's as bad as you think it is because someone else has it worse. So any contribution you can do to help this family out, they didn't ask me for it. They're not asking for it. I'm taking upon myself to see what I could do to help out that family. Byron, is that okay with you? Because this is our show and I had talked to you this beforehand, yes. right? And the fact that he was going to be a fireman shows the type of family this is, right? Because you don't go to be a fireman because you're not going to run into a fire, a fire, right? You're running into danger. And Byron, you were a sheriff, right? You were served. You're running into it, right? So, so please, anything you could help out um, my friends, you know, 
and I'm going to promote it for the next several shows and, and in everything I can. Um, I just, I love that family. I, I mean, everyone from the, from the brothers, one of my best friends, um, and this is his sister and, and his nephew to, 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 I, I, I don't know how to explain my, my, my empathy and my, um, and my, and my love for that family. But, but the fact that, 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 that the, the, the young man is making strides and, and what he was about to, about to get engaged and stuff, just, just the whole story just really affected me. And it made me realize, stop being a wimp, Victor, when you think you got a bad. Right. And I was being honestly a wimp. Okay. And, 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 and it showed me that there's way more things to life than worrying about stupid stuff that I let bother me than things like this that can happen. So if you could help out, please check out the GoFundMe page and help us out. Um,